Both the men's and women's Florida State cross country teams are wrapping up their preparations for their most important meet to date as they head up to Boston for the battle in Beantown. This weekend, we're not going to really change the race strategy so much because we've done really well as working on different packs, but we are going to race harder. So it's going to be a great opportunity to go in against top ranked teams. Like you said, a lot of North New England schools are up there. So um, the competition is going to be phenomenal. But so it'll be nice to see how they react when they're not the top dogs. And it's just like, okay, how are we going to do, you know, can we get re-ranked? You know, we need to get back in the rankings. So that's, that's the ultimate goal. We've got a young team, but I think the last race we did, we had a lot of surprises, which we like weren't expecting to, you know, come as close a pack as we did. Like Christine had an amazing race. Um, and I think we're just sort of, you know, keeping the pack close is really important because when you're running with your teammates, it makes, you know, that 6K a lot easier. Um, so yeah, definitely keeping the pack close and just trying to help each other out like we do in workouts really. I think when the team comes together in Boston, we actually try and attack this race as previously. We've just tried to keep it controlled. We'll, um, we'll do pretty well. It's going to be a challenge. I mean, uh, we still aren't, you know, we still got our junior college national champion who we won't have until the home meet the next week. So we'll be one big piece short, but that doesn't really matter. I think we've got really good depth this year where we can be solid and maybe pick up some wins along the way.